Hi folks, I'm here to announce a new firmware update, version 7.2. This is a very exciting release because we've added support for USB modem redundancy on the Dovato Pro. And basically it means that you can have a primary USB modem can be inserted, such as in this case, into the port 1. And then you can have a backup modem running, for instance, 3G prepaid in port 2. And to configure the, the two modems, you just go to the router's admin page, you go to the modem section, and then you go to modem settings. And in modem settings, you define two modems as opposed to uh, one modem, which is default. And then you select which um, port should be the primary and which port should be secondary is automatically selected as a result. Then to configure each modem, you click here on USB modem one, you type in the APM, and if you which setting network preference you want on that modem, well, by default it's automatic. And if it speeds things up for you, you can always select 4G only or 3G only. And then USB 2, select that one, and you insert the APN for that one, pin code, etc., if need be. Now, we've also added support for the connection tracker to work with VPN. So I have a VPN connection up at the top from the router and uh, that works very well now. And we've also uh, provided you the possibility to select which order uh, you want for the failover to occur. So if you have a Ethernet WAN port is occupied with maybe a fixed broadband connection, you can have that as the primary internet access. Then the first USB modem can be the secondary and the second USB modem can be the tertiary um, connection. You can also do SMS in and out uh, via both modems. However, um, on the inbound, uh, you, you will receive on either modem, but on the outbound, it will, it will send out of the primary modem. And uh, if the primary modem is missing, then it will go out through the secondary modem. So what is this good for? Well, uh, in the, there's many purposes. We've gotten over the years a lot of people asking us what to do, how, how if we can implement um, modem redundancy. And for instance, you got shipping companies, so they cross borders. Um, I even have a guy who, who has his own um, small Cessna plane, so he flies uh, from, from one country to another, uh, and then he wants to just be able to turn on the router and have it automatically connect to whatever uh, it, it can in whichever country it's in. And then, of course, in the machine-to-machine -machine, uh, segment, this will provide high uptime, so making sure that uh, the internet is never uh, down for longer than a couple of minutes. And uh, you can also use this, for instance, in the case where if you're out in your summer cottage and you have maybe normally high uptime on your 4G, but, you know, bad weather or some network maintenance occurs, and it's good to have a 3G prepaid stick from a second mobile operator. Uh, for that, uh, for those occasions, well, we hope there's also a bunch of new features that that came in with 7.2. Hope you have a chance to re read the release notes, and also um, those features are also available for the other routers. So the exception here is um, USB modem redundancy for the Pro, and um, the ability to plug in a three or a hard disk larger than three terabytes in the second USB port. Um, we hope you enjoyed this release and please get in touch with us if you have any questions. Thank you. Bye-bye.